This Asia-Pacific Parliamentary Forum was the 27th forum that gathered about 26 different countries around the Asia-Pacific. And so our involvement in that forum is very good and very important. And for me the trip was really amazing because I got to meet with a lot of other women MPs from around uh, the Asia-Pacific region. And um, we also spent some time with some of the women MPs from Malaysia. And just amazing how a lot of the issues we're dealing with are the same. But also tied in with the need for gender equity and women's representation in Parliament. So very big focus of discussion. We had many bilateral uh, discussions also during the visit to Cambodia and obviously in Malaysia. The same issues were being discussed in every country and I think that was a real opportunity for us to exchange ideas. Malaysia was a very interesting visit. We did engage with their parliament very strongly. We had a two hour discussion with the speaker and about 10 other MPs who are looking at reforming their political system and the electoral system. Another thing that came up was climate change and that was something that was a focus of the Asia Pacific Parliamentary Forum. So it was really good to be able to share what New Zealand's doing, looking at our zero carbon bill, consultation on the emissions trading scheme. We seem to be all very similar in terms of that desire to look at what we're doing, but then the hard issues of implementation and how we move forward together. One thing which I have always enjoyed on these trips is that uh, the cohesiveness among the members over here, mm -hmm. and we represent New Zealand. There is no party, party politics at all, and that shows that how passionate we are about New Zealand. I think that it was well worth it, and certainly as a, as a growing experience as a parliamentarian to interact and engage with other parliamentarians across the region uh, and to come back to appreciate what we actually have here in New Zealand. <music>